welcome back to my channel in today's video i'll be using a new to me shampoo and conditioner and this is from bath and body works this is their shampoo and conditioner y'all it is originally two for 24 dollars, but i got two for uh nine dollars each so with that being said i saw that they had hair products i didn't know they had hair products let me know if y'all knew um, right now I'm just washing out my washing, not my washing go, my ponytail, you know, there's gel all up in here. So I just got to let that out. But yeah, this, this ponytail was laid. So a bunch of gel, just trying to let the water run on my edges, on my scalp, get it out. But back to the shampoo and conditioner, um, the shampoo, I got them in champagne toast, but they also had Japanese blossom and thousand wishes and other scents as well but champagne toast is one of my favorite other ones that i saw it comes in 16 fluid ounces so it's pretty big and it says it's a moisturizing shampoo the fragrance notes are bubbly champagne sparkling berries and juicy tangerine made with vitamin vitamin b5 aloe and vitamin e this says it's supposed to gently cleanse and hydrate to restore softness and shine when you use with moisturizing conditioner Strengthens and protects against breakage while looking, but while locking in moisture. Safe for oil. Oh, y'all can't read. Safe for safe for all hair types and color treated hair. Now the some of the ingredients are water, sodium, sulfonate. So it has sulfates in there. Um, some other sodiums. Not a lot of good ingredients. Perfume is really high up there. So with the shampoo, I'll say it's very thick, it's pearlized, so it's supposed to be moisturizing, and it suds up really well. A little bit goes a very long way, and so I was a little bit heavy-handed in the beginning, just because I wasn't sure. Um, what I liked about the shampoo is that it got my hair clean. It definitely got my hair clean, and my hair did not feel stripped afterwards, but it was hard to detangle, and I don't really care if you can or can't. The tangle with shampoo but it's something i try because sometimes you can and in this case i couldn't really it was not tangling my hair because my hair was already tangled kind of because i didn't pre-poo and so i feel like with this shampoo i would definitely want to pre-poo because it would just make the whole process easier so because i didn't pre-poo this was a very hard wash day let me just say that okay very hard the shampoo part was easy but that's all that was easy. Um, so I did two washes and yeah, it's just like a shampoo. Nothing crazy, nothing special. Would I say you have to run out and get it? No, but if you wanna try it, go for it. Um, yeah, now I'm gonna finish the shampoo for sure. And that's everything I have to say about the shampoo. Um, if I had to rate it, I'd probably give it like a 6.5 out of 10. Um, but I would definitely want to use it up. It definitely got my hair cleaned. It didn't feel stripped. It just uh, wasn't my favorite, you know. There's better things on the market, obviously. And so I just really wanted to try it because I saw that they had it when I went in store. And so, yeah, you guys are just going to see me finish washing my hair. And then I'll come back to talk about the conditioner.
all right guys so this is what my hair is looking like after i shampoo it looks good shiny um all my hair is clean nothing nothing bad uh really you know but it definitely needs to be conditioned like normal well normally i don't condition my hair because i feel like it's a waste of time and an extra step but since they don't have a deconditioner, I was like, let me try the conditioner. So this also comes in 16 floor ounces, which I appreciate because we have a lot of hair over here. And um, a little bit of this does not go a long way. And so I went over a good amount. I used like a third of, of the bottle. I have like two more uses if I decide to use it again. It has the same fragrances, fragrance notes as the other one so bubbly champagne sparkling berries juicy tangerine vitamin b5 aloe vitamin e this says detangles and restores softness and shine when used with the moisturizer shampoo strengthens against breakage while locking in moisture safe for all hair types or color treated hair uh, made without sulfates parabens or artificial dyes no animal testing. The directions is, and this is water, aloe, leaf juice, acetyl alcohol, dimethicone. So there is a silicone in here. Um, fragrance. The list is way shorter on the conditioner than it is the shampoo. And uh, I can actually read this stuff. But when I say this conditioner was trash... I don't think it's gonna to touch my hair again. It was so hard to detangle, okay? Now, it make it look easy in this clip right here once you get it through, but this, the front is like kinda of looser than the rest of my hair, and so it was just really hard. It took a while to get it through, and I used, like I said, a third of the bottle, but the worst part was when I was rinsing my hair out it rinsed out very nicely, very fast, you know. It was going good. But my hair felt stripped, okay? This was not moisturizing. This was so bad. My hair felt dry as the Sahara Desert. The shampoo didn't even strip my hair like this. I feel like the labels were switched. If the consistency wasn't like a conditioner consistency, I would be like, this is definitely a shampoo. It gave shampoo vibes. My hair was so dry, y'all. Like, it didn't make no sense. And so, not that I wasn't going to deep condition after this step. I definitely had to deep condition. because It just felt like I shampooed my hair three times, at least. It was so dry. I could not believe it. Not only did it take long to put in, it didn't help with detangling. It stripped my hair. Y'all, this is what my hair was looking like. To me, it doesn't look moisturized. It doesn't look like it did anything. I feel like this is still results from the shampoo. So overall, this is what I used on the shampoo. This is what I used on the conditioner. Not using it again, but I just wanted to try it for you guys. If you tried it, let me know. If you guys like this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.